area law officers are on the hunt this evening for savage bandits who attacked two senior citizens outside banks in two counties. Andy Cordan has been tracking this crime and joins us with the latest. Andy. Hey there, Mark. You know, this crime is almost diabolical. It begins last Tuesday outside of Brentwood Bank, and it happens in broad daylight. According to bank surveillance, at 11.35 a.m., a 68-year-old man enters the Truist Bank on Mallory Lane in Brentwood. 30 seconds later, a man now identified as DeAndre Robinson follows him in. According to the affidavit, the 32-year-old man makes no banking transactions and exits the bank some two minutes later. When the senior citizen leaves, that's when a masked man brandishing a gun reportedly demands the senior's money, then pistol whips the victim severely, ultimately stealing his bank envelope. The senior will suffer multiple head wounds, and he's rushed to a hospital. According to Metro Police, two hours later, it happens again. This time at this truest bank in Jolton. This is surveillance footage from the bank. Investigators say it shows DeAndre Robinson following a 91-year-old woman into the bank. According to Metro officials, Robinson conducts no business and soon leaves. When the 91-year-old woman leaves the bank, two men, they have masks and they have guns. They begin to chase her and then they knock her down. And once on the ground, they grab that money and take off. Metro and Brentwood investigators will track Robinson here to Putnam Drive in Bordeaux. Before he's captured, investigators say Robinson tosses this handgun, which Metro police indicate had been stolen some two years ago during a vehicle burglary in Nashville. Now, I spoke with the 68-year-old man who was attacked in Brentwood, and he politely declined to comment for the story. But according to investigators, his injuries required more than a dozen staples and stitches to patch up that head wound that he had sustained in the attack. We'll send it back to you, Mark.